Hey guys, welcome back. Today I want to address the question that's been sent to me and asked in the comments lately is where to buy watches online. And uh, I've been, I always recommend uh, if it's a brand like something like Tag Heuer or something like that, I always recommend to get it used because that in that case you will get the value for your money, the bang for your buck. And uh, most of these watches are best value when you buy them used. Of course, if you have the cash, if you have the money, it's best to buy brand new because in that way you get a five year guarantee and all the other stuff. One thing before buying used is that you firstly have to hunt and find and search a proper decent watchmaker who will take care of your watches who will do a maintenance just like you have a maintenance on your car because in lots of these cases uh watches when you buy them online especially vintage watches they are gonna require service and uh, most of the watches i buy i do service because i have a watchmaker that's uh, 10 minutes away from my home walking and uh, we have a good relationship and being that i live here in europe prices are not that expensive so you need to have a watchmaker nearby available because you cannot be sending that watch to europe uh, to omega to have it serviced and wait for three months it's a good thing but I, me personally i don't want to service winter geneve and omega pay a thousand euros for it uh, when my watchmaker can do it for a hundred so yeah firstly you need to take care of that secondly this this is not a a paid review this is not a promotion this is just simply uh how i do it so no david as w david as w uh anyways so yeah i gotta ask uh is it safe for me to buy watch from ebay that it's used and uh ebay is a great place to buy watches but you need to know it's not for a newbie it's not for a watch newbie so it's a great place and one of those places that you can find a great deals great bargains as just like you buy a used baseball bat or a glove whatever you buy in these days i buy only watches uh, so i don't have lots of experience but yeah eBay is a great place to buy some used watches. Uh, there are some big reputable sellers, but you need to first hunt down the watch you want. For example, you want to use for this, you want to use to sell. You go out there, you find the watch, find the right price for you. Uh, check out the buyer, check out his feedback. Uh, maybe he has a tons of positive feedback and a couple of negatives. Everyone has it's not normal that someone has a 5,000 positive feedbacks and zero negative feedback. So check out, see his replies to that negative feedback. Did he offer to return the watch, to service it, to return the money? Do your research, use some common sense, and it's very easy to find it. And with eBay, you have PayPal, and wherever you buy it from, use PayPal. You charge you pay a bit more for a fee but paypal takes good care of a buyer and if you are a seller and you sell something through paypal then basically i don't remember ever a case uh, in history of paypal that paypal sided with the seller they always take buyer side they take care of their buyers they protect their buyers and uh, if there's any issue uh, PayPal will take care of you, you will get your money back. So recently I bought some things off eBay uh, that did never arrive, like two months later it did not arrive and I got my money back from PayPal, so nothing was there. And uh, if you are living in America, Canada and some normal world, you can, it's usually local websites for you so you can easily return the item if you don't like it so i see no if i was living in america i would be all over that ebay but usually a passage fee for me is like 
up to 100 bucks, sometimes 60, sometimes 50, sometimes more than the item is worth. And uh, that's why I don't like it. So um, what I do personally uh, is there's a local website. Every country has its own local website. My country has OLX. It's like our own version of eBay. Uh, it's more like a Craigslist than eBay, but I monitor it all the time and looking for a good watch deals. Yeah, Piaget. And I monitor it all the time and I'm all over it and I'm buying it. Uh, OLX is not like P PayPal, it's more like a Craigslist, you exchange money physically, so you need to know a little bit more about watches, you need to have, to have some watch tools to check out, inspect the watches, but for a new build buyer, eBay is a great place for used watches. If you know any other website for used watches, do write in the comment section, share it down below next page i recommend if you want to hunt around shop around amazon amazon is great especially when the, there's a discount season amazon uh, usually has some of the best deals around also i hear joma shop is a very good place to buy watches sometimes listen to me sometimes uh, there is no point to buying a used watch when you can buy a brand new for 10 bucks. The simplest example for this is Orient Mako or Orient Ray. You go on eBay and search Orient Ray used, you will see the prices that are usually in the same or $10 less than the brand new from, uh, I don't know, from Marks, Long Island Watch, Joma Shop, Croatian Watches, and many other places. So you need to shop around, compare prices, do your research, and some of the watches. I remember a couple years ago on Joma Shop there was a Moon Watch. You can you could get it for just a couple hundreds over uh, used prices. So there, I see no sense buying. For, I would rather pay the extra 200 bucks and buy it from a Joma shop, brand new. It is a great dealer, but it's not otherwise, but you get it cheaper than a used one with no absolute guarantee. At least you buy it brand new. So sometimes uh, it, it depends. You should hunt some watches. Creation Watches is a website. Sometimes they can mess around, but usually they have a good reviews. I bought some Seikos from them and uh, they are from, I don't know, Singapore, from Asia, and they're a good source for some Seiko Orient watches. If you're looking to a Seiko Flight Master with the yellow hands, uh, they usually sometimes have it much cheaper than some of the you know, naughty eBay sellers. So yeah, you just need to use some common sense, do your research, compare prices. Sometimes the, the brand new price of the item is close to the used one it's it doesn't make any sense you just pay a little bit more and get the brand new one like in case of orient mako uh, and uh, lots of other watches so ebay is a safe place but uh, wherever you buy it from your watches uh, use paypal another great place to buy used watches is on forums what you seek has a great sales corner. Many other forums, from Rolex forum to Omega forums, you name it, every major brand has their own forum. Be a member there. And on forums, you can always ask the fellow people from the fellow members on the forum, what do you think about this watch? Is this watch correct? Even I, uh, when I want, wanted to buy my Submariner or Datejust, I went to the Rolex forum and posted a couple of photos and asked, does this look correct? Is, do you see anything that I don't see? Because those guys are experts in that particular brand and I don't have a lot of experience with Rolex. So always go on forums. There's a sales corner over there, always bargains and lots of good guys out there that can help you out, make a decision and can help you out uh, find a service and they, they can help you out uh, to get that deal and bargain done so yeah that's it uh, 
the UIQC guys this was not a sponsor no one paid me to mention anything uh, but uh, this is uh, how I do it always go local see something better the best place is to get it in person if you're getting going to buy a watch in person especially if it's a lot of money it's always a good idea to meet at the AD so you can verify the watch and also if you don't have an AD or someone like that somewhere public uh, so to avoid any kinds of dangers because there are lots of dangers out there so general PayPal is your friend if you're a buyer if you're a seller not so much so thank you for watching I'm EDC Gunner uh, hopefully this video helps you and uh, if it helps at least one person I'm this whole video will be success and do share in your comment section down below your experiences and recommendation for websites so thank you for watching